Um, but going back to leopards was the right choice at the time because we're still in Polokwane. Mm-hmm. It went wrong when they appointed Coach Siema as my assistant. Mm. It went wrong. Were you not given opportunity to bring your own assistant? No. I, I haven't seen you as a coach that usually bring his own no, assistant. No, I... You, you always work with what they always give Always work with what they are. And yeah, you know, because most coaches, they move with their assistant. But you, I think, each time you move, you work with whoever you find. Yeah, there. you get the opportunity to do a local coach, especially yeah. the coaches who have been there a long time. Morgan at uh, Black Leopards, uh, Toker at Barocca, at TTM, I had Paul Maleka, mm. you know, who was my former player at yeah. Black Aces. Mm. And here, I had Fanny Madida. Mm. Um, he, was, he was good for me. Fanny yeah. was good for me. So was Musa. So mm. was Musa and Tella, uh, who are there now at the moment. Yeah. Uh, but I've never had the opportunity to bring Your own. my own coach. Yeah. And it, it kind of... It, 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 it's been okay with Musa and it was okay with Fanny. Um, Morgan, not so. Coach Siema was a disaster. So after they appoint you, did they appoint Siema after you? Yes, they appointed. Did they consult you to say we think? No, they didn't consult me. They just said, you know, we're bringing. Uh, David looked at uh, the Sundowns model, two, three coaches. Mm. So he thought that Siema. But I know, I, I knew from the minute I, I actually sat in the office, mm. I should have, I should have resigned. I should have walked away. How was it disaster if, uh, if you explain because I can tell you felt day one that this is not going to work. No, it wasn't going to work. Siema wanted the job. Mm. Siema wanted the job. He didn't want to assist. No, I didn't want to be assistant. You know, I, I, uh, when, I looked in, when I looked into his eyes, you know, you can see the, you can see this, this, the, oh, coach, I can't wait to work with you. It's a pleasure to work with you. But when you look deeper, you mm. look deeper through them eyes, you know, mm. it's not going to work. Yeah. And, the first day in training, I arrived an hour early, like I always do, to set everything up. Yeah. And CM was there setting everything up. I went, whoa, 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 what are you doing? You don't know how we play. You don't know how we work. No, who's, no. who's asking? Coach CM. He set everything up. When you get there one hour before, you already found him there. He's already there setting things set up. Set up the training session. And, and I told him it wasn't his responsibility. Mm. No, you know, I'm, he doesn't know the team. He doesn't know the players. He doesn't know what we do mm. or how we play. And then... I knew then, you know, you know that, that, that he, he, he had an agenda. Mm. He had an agenda. And we had a game against Pirates. Mm. And the chairman came in to have a meeting with everybody. Mm. And he told me if, I was, if we lose to Pirates, I was finished. And, you know, I'm, 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 I'm a useless coach. That's a pre-match This is a meeting. pre-match meeting, yeah. Is the, the chairman, night before. is the chairman telling you that? That's the night before. Yeah. He's come down, he spoke to the players, spoke to all the coaching staff. We beat ty- Pirates 2-0. Mm. Siemma's on the bench like this. Everybody's celebrating. Mm. Everybody's celebrating. We beat Pirates 2-0. Siemma's like that on the bench. And then the next game was against his former team, Chipper. Mm. We'd just been fired by. Mm. And I said, look, you know their team better than me. Can mm. you do the, what do you think? Shall I play him? Shall I play him? What, what do you think of the makeup? Yeah. And we agreed that we'd change King and Glove for, I can't remember the, the keeper's name now. Uh, we dropped was King. Was the, uh, the guy from, he was an international. Yeah. Guy, the Tark doll guy. Yes. Yeah. Uh, tall and dark. Uh, he was from one of the... Uh, some Ghana. Yeah. yeah. He played in the champion. Uh, yes. Afcon, yes. And then you brought him to yes. Leopards. So, Mendes. Mendes, yeah, Mendes. So, King had a bad foot, so I dropped King and I took Ramagala. I, I dropped him because he wasn't giving me anything. Ramagala. Yep, yep. I, he wasn't giving us anything. Um, and we sat, discussed it, we both agreed. He told me the makeup of the chipper team, which was the complete opposite. It didn't come out that way. No, did he, Al? I mean, he, he, he basically told me, you know, this was a, he, he was not a good player. He was not a good player. He was, they were the best players for Chipper, mm. right? But I gave him the role because he yeah. was, I thought because he'd been fired by them two weeks ago yes. before. He, he knows them. That he would know them and he'd, he'd want to get one up on them, but no, mm. no. So we had a big altercation in the dressing room at half time. Half time, what's the score? We, we were losing 2-0. Mm. We were losing 2-0. The t- players that he told me were rubbish, they were brilliant, hmm. you know, and, and he, ma- he, he, he made a call to Ramagala, Ramag- Ramag- 
Rama Galela. Rama, Rama G. Galela. Rama yeah. G. Yeah. Took him off the come off the bench and I said, "What are you doing?" He says, "No, we've got to get Rama on." I said, "But you told me last night your decision, your opinion was Rama Galela's not going to play." Mm. 